So we covered this game on the channel a while back. It's called Happy Room. It's weird. It's like one of those pimple popping or earwax videos that you find yourself watching in the middle of the night. Me? No, don't be silly. I don't watch stuff like that. You could put down devices to do damage to these guys and get more money to do damage to them in a weird way. There's a bunch of challenges here. And it's a crash test dummy, right? But there's blood? Watch. That's... What is, the crash test dummy juice doesn't look like that, you know? So that's the whole thing. So there's a bunch of different challenges you could get. I played a little bit just to familiarize myself. And this is the dungeon update, so it's a little bit different. So we could do 900 damage from spiders, but I don't have that unlocked yet. So let's try to do 1,000 damage here. One of the things you can do is set bombs all over the place. These are really, really cheap, and... Uh, if we put enough of them in one place, we could probably get that done. So, so let's see. Actually, I'm going to take this one away. And let's put some jump pads down. All right. So we still have 241 bucks left. Might as well just put some things down that can actually, um, like, do some damage or whatever. Yeah, that'll work. Okay, let's try it. All right, good. We're taking damage. We're taking 115 damage at a time. It's just going to bounce us up. Like, do, do people really find a lot of enjoyment in this? I personally think it's interesting to to see the things that you could do with the traps and stuff, but it looks like we got what we wanted. We did the damage that we wanted, okay? So now we have to do 800 damage with a minigun, for instance. And we have saws unlocked, too, which is kind of... 300 damage from a saw. Okay, let's erase all of this stuff. So, how do saws place here? Let's see. If we put saws just like this, and can we reverse? Yeah, there we go. Okay, so let's just reverse the trajectory here. And I guess down here we'll do um, we'll do a jump pad. And we'll do jump pads like, let's, let's just try a couple of them right here and right here. That way, if they kind of spring off course, they it might do damage here. So it's just going to kind of... Oh, yeah. That's... See, it's clearly not a crash test dummy. That's... It is clearly... Um, oh, I can see what's going to happen here. I think the same design as we had last time, honestly, is probably better. So let's... If we clear all this, put a bunch of jump pads right here. That way, they just... It just keeps on bouncing to the same side of the room, right? We're gonna get boring with this stuff here. Let's just do it like that. The jump pad, uh, stuff wears out too, which is also weird. Okay, uh, so we go to saw blades now, and I guess we just put a bunch of them that point this away. Oh, we could do a lot too. So that way if they break, it'll still be fine. How about we make just like a little conveyor belt for them? Yeah, 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 okay. Let's try that out. Okay, so we bounce left, and we just kind of ride the saw blades until they break. Yep, just like that. Okay. Uh, I don't think we're going to make it right there. What we probably need is the conveyor belts going backwards. Okay, stop this mess. Stop it, stop it, stop it. Let's make it go this way. Okay. And let's make all of these go this way, too. Oop. All of these go this way. That way, it'll roll right back on to the spring pads. And uh, and that should work. Okay, let's try this. Okay, so yeah. Uh-huh. Come on back. Yes. All right. Beautiful. That's exactly what we want to happen. Wow, we're doing plenty of damage. Look at this meter. See, I guess that's the challenge of it. I, I guess that's really the thing. Like, you can you can really mess around with the challenges and, and get them done. Uh this is probably going to break, and that's going to be the end. But we have, uh, oh, use up to four, use up four saws. We had three done here. So we got that goal, but we can do some more. Use up four saws. Why don't we take away this and just try that again? So hopefully they come back to that. When it passes on them again... It's very, very close to breaking them. I think this is going to do it right here. We got, like, how many do we have? 
Is my foot is... Oh, no. I don't think... Maybe. Just maybe. Yeah, we got it. We got it. We got it. That was barely, though. Like, my foot's just bouncing right there. Okay. So, we got it. So, we're making money every time we do this. And we get new stuff that unlocks, too. So, they have general damage numbers that you can do, too. When this number gets to this level right here, you start getting some more unlocks. And that's what we need to get miniguns, which is one of the challenges. And these forks seem to work pretty darn well as well. Like, they just do a little bit of damage or whatever. We're, we're past the mark that we were. And I don't know if it's going to put it... Oh, yeah. It's going to get there. So we made it. All of these uh, saws are pretty much dead. And so is, so is our, our dummy, I guess you could call him. Uh, but um, we may have got the unlocks now. So we got a new record with 60 bucks, but we're still not quite there. So we're going to have to make this a little bit more impressive. So I think it's pretty safe to say that a crossbow might be pretty good. Um, I don't know if we used all of these last time, so let's just take away this one and we'll add another one. And that way, when they're just on the, the grind here, so to speak, oh god, I can't believe I just said that, uh, that it'll work pretty good. Let's move these out, take this away, add one more crossbow to the deal, and um, and and here we go. Uh, that's not going to work at all, is it? Okay, now we now we now we're working on something. Crossbows are hitting it really nice. Is it gonna go far enough? Oh yeah, and it's gonna hit all the the right spots, so to speak. If we would want to really make sure the uh, the saw blades would work, we could angle them down, It'd be like a downward slope, so to speak. And it looks like we really only ever need one jumper pad, so we could probably afford a little bit more there. The jumper pad could be a little bit closer, too. Hmm. Okay. Jump pad a little bit closer. Okay. Let's take this one away. We'll just add a, just a, another crossbow. And let's run this at two times. The music actually goes two times as well. That's hilarious. Okay, new weapon, teleport. So we got it. It's done. And stop. Okay, so we got the teleport weapon. Now we can wipe all of this stuff. And teleport a dummy is one of the things that we need. Oh, look, we got spiders too. 900 damage from spiders. Hi. Right. So what's a teleport? Do ah, it's a portal. Okay. So we could do a portal here and a portal here. And um, we can just put some spiders... Uh, let's see. Let's just put a spider there. Oh. I don't know exactly what they do. That's a lot of spiders, though. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> they just... <laughs> they web his face. Alright, I'm starting to understand why this game may be a little bit fun. Because I kind of just want to see... What is going to happen next, you know? It's, I don't know, it's it's different than a pimple popping video, okay? Again, I don't watch those things. People that watch those things are gross. I'm not kink shaming you, I'm just saying. Alright, this is going to be some elaborate shit right here. Let's do it like this. This is going to be some elaborate stuff right here. Oh, we got all the spiders <laughs> stuck into the wall too. Test of endurance deal 2,000 damage. I think it's safe to say that we got the teleport done, we got the spider done. That's that's pretty darn good. Okay. So, let's see what we have now. 2,000 damage. We got really close to that last time with just what we had. So what if we do the same thing with the saw blades here? And uh, we add the same things that we did with the pitchforks. If they don't go through the ceiling couple pitchforks here. And let's see. We still have 921 bucks left. So we can do the spiders as well. I don't know how well the spiders did in terms of damage. But we can try it. And that's it. Three of them. Okay. Let's just let's let, let her rip. Okay. The spiders are just chewing on his face. All right. Everything is working according to plan here. 
Uh, is he going to let go? Yep, that's exactly what we were hoping for. Another chance to do damage. This jumper is almost done, which is not great. What we could have did is did a second jumper right there, and I think that would have been fine. The bad thing about that is we're a little bit short on money. Okay, another 151 bucks. Um, I'm thinking that... What the hell can we do with that? I'm just going to add another saw blade. And let's try it at two times speed. Nothing new to see here. Oh, my leg got stuck. And I think it's pretty much over. <laughs> okay. That looked like some RNG kind of got to us, right? Let's try it again. Hot damn! Minigun unlocked! Yeah! This is like my go-to default design, man. It's like my bread and butter design. Okay, we have to make 20 arrows miss a dummy? Or do 800 damage with a minigun? How do miniguns work? Ah, you have to place them to the wall. Okay. Um... Might be kind of hard. 375 bucks a piece. I guess miniguns could be pretty expensive. Okay, so just out of curiosity, let's see how these things work. All right. So if we put another jump pad here and we press play, we do a little bit of damage that way. We keep getting shot. All right, I can see what's going on here now. So we put another jump pad here. Uh, and let's put more miniguns. Aha! Well. More where that came from, honey. Okay, getting shot, good. Getting shot more, good. Keep just going back for more. Yep, that's what I like to see. When the miniguns break, they'll eventually stop shooting so the bottom ones can get to us. All right, that's all of them. That's all of them. We almost made our damage cap, but that was uh, that was pretty easy to do, actually. And as far as missing with a crossbow is concerned, you know what? The teleport thing that we had going on earlier, what if we just did like an infinite loop? And what if we just did like a lot of crossbows around? How about that? <laughs> Twenty arrows miss a dummy. <laughs> that was easy, dude. Like, really easy. <laughs> so now we just have to do enough damage to get to axes so that we can unlock fresh cuts. So check this out. We could do 50% more damage install on the floor or ceiling when you get this. So look at this. Watch it is, man. We're going to get more damage this way. We got the same conveyor belt. I flipped it around just so y'all wouldn't get too bored. Same thing with the jump pads as we had last time, and we need to get damage done. So let's try it out. We still got 549 bucks. I just want to see how this works. Okay, it kind of pushes them along. There we go. Hey, that wasn't bad. I have a feeling it's not going to be quite enough, though. Oh, look at that. Yeah, okay. I see the problem here already. Let's move this just a little bit. There we go. I think it's going to be just fine right here. And we still have 549 bucks. Why don't we just add like another minigun? 
Same deal, pretty much. Kind of pushes them along. They do a ton of damage, man. We're almost at the limit. Yes, go back. Beautiful. So I finished up. God, so close, man. Yeah, we got it. New weapon axe. I'm surprisingly good at this game. Oh, and it just keeps on going. Keeps on going. Oh, it died. <laughs> well, that was all right. We uh, we got another another little bundle of money to try to use, so we could just add another minigun, for instance. Oh, no, we couldn't do that. We could add a crossbow or something just to do some more damage and keep pushing that limit, but that's uh, pretty interesting. 23 humans uh crash test dummies later and uh we got a few challenges unlocked i hope y'all enjoyed the video guys thank y'all so much for watching as always this is ulgen signing off and we'll see you next time Break it down.